What is up, YouTube? It's your boy Savan the Don back at you again with another YouTube video. And I'm telling you guys, stay tuned because my social media will be right after this video. But thank you guys for tuning into another YouTube video with Savan the Don, the one and only the Don. But in this video, we're gonna be talking about the time I got catfished. <sighs> if you're new to the channel, like and subscribe, and uh, yeah, let's get into it. All right, y'all, so this is what happened. Let's flash back to the year 2014, I think. I would say 2014. I used to live in an old neighborhood. I used to live, that used to be uh, near this rec center. And um, I still uh, have church there and stuff, but that's besides the point. So I used to live next to this rec center and it used to be this big old park next to it that I've never really been up to. And I guess I was on this app called Meet Me. A lot of people know what that is. I don't get on there no more because yeah, it's just stupid. But I got on the app and I was like, oh, this girl looks, you know, kind of cute. You know, she got a little, you know, a little something on her. So I'm like, okay, okay, let me go ahead and hit her up. So I was like, okay, I hit her up. And then that's when kick and stuff was relevant. So, um, while kicking stuff was relevant, she was uh, we was kicking each other and stuff, and we and I was like, well, where do you live and stuff? I was like, you know, maybe we can meet up one day, and she was like, um, well, I live blah blah blah, and I was like, oh, I live near there too, and I totally forgot the girl's name, so we're just gonna say her name is uh, Cindy, yeah, Cindy. So Cindy was like, okay, I live there too. Maybe we should meet up at the at the park next to the rec center and go to the rec center one day. So. <clears throat> I said, bet. I'm not, I don't really be doing nothing after school anyway, so why not? You know, 14, 15 years old, I need to get out of the house anyway. So, what ended up happening was, I was like, okay, I'm not doing nothing tonight. So, you know, it was dark. I was like, well, it was getting dark. I was like, let me walk up there and then I'll wait for you. And then the first time that happened, she never came. So I went back home. And I was mad and I was like, well, I'm never about that. I'm not about to do that again no more because yeah, that you're wasting my time. And uh, it took her a while to message me back, but she messaged me back and she was like, okay, that was my fault. Something came up. I'm like, okay, that's fine. You know, I still, I'm still not talking to nobody else. So, you know, we can still meet up. So I was like, okay, let's meet up. So once again, before it got dark, I went up there to, um, to, uh, I started walking up to the girl meet her. So, like I, okay. If I could describe the girl, Sydney, to you, she was decent looking. I couldn't tell her what type of body she had because really, she didn't take any body pictures. And in her picture, her face looked decent too. So I was like, okay, okay, I could work with that. I could work with that. So then, this is what happened. I walked up there, which was, it wasn't even a three minute walk. It was like right around the corner from my house. I walked up there and I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. And all of a sudden, here come, okay, let me try to be nice with this. Here come this sloppy built buck tooth girl. That was as nice as I could get. And that wasn't nice at all. I could not put it any more nicer. Here comes this girl and I'm like, oh my goodness. What did I get myself into? So. I was like, wow, I don't know what's going on, but I'm already up here now and I don't feel like walking back home and it's gonna be really disrespectful to just like, just do the dash and cut out home. I should have, but I didn't. So I was like, okay, see what she looked like. No, it was horrible. She had buck teeth. She, her face was like crunched in and stuff. And oh, she had a unibrow, it was horrible. And I hung out with her that whole night. Like after that, we had went to the rec center for a little bit and shot around. I was so embarrassed because there was other dudes up there that was like around my age and I was bringing her around like she was a prize or something. So yeah, I was just like, man, this was dumb. I never saw her again after that. She wanted to meet up with me again at the park, but I guess she moved to Greenwood. Um, so yeah, I don't, yeah. It was a horrible experience. It really was. It was something, sadly, it was something to do with that while I was bored, but I really didn't expect her to look like that. In her picture, she did not. I should have asked her for pictures, and I learned from that experience by asking for pictures. And if you can't provide me with pictures or you can't video chat me, then you're not who you say you are. Um, 
a lot of people will say that that's not catfish because she didn't use other people's pictures but the thing is if you sitting here hiding the fact what you look like and having to hide the fact what your body looks like in order to go see somebody that you think is nice looking that's lying or as they call it in the 21st century catfishing so that's why she i say that she catfished me so yeah that was a story i don't talk to her no more it's been a while been like a year or two since I've talked to that girl. Like I said, she moved to Greenwood. So it was just like, yeah, and I didn't want to hang out with her again after that. She tried to ask me to come over one time. I'm like, nah, bruh, you Gucci off of that one. You're Gucci, I'm Gucci off of that one. I don't even want to know, no shade at all. I didn't want no part of that at all. That's gonna wrap up today's story time of the time I got catfish. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I have more intriguing story times to, to come. Um, I'm, I'm debating if I wanna do one. I don't know, I'm gonna have to see, but I'm debating if I really wanna do one. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for 200 subscribers. Make sure you guys go watch my other YouTube video um, when I went to trip to the thrift and Pellers Mall to check that out, leave a like. Make sure you like and subscribe and share the crap out of this video. And um, I think that's all I have to say. Uh, I'm swimming down and I'm out. Now a nigga signed a hoe, took a power trip back home. I'm grown now and the city's my throne now. Huh?